God bless everyone joining at this time. This is a prophetic service prophet prophesying. My time has come. Your time has come. Count your blessings one by one and it will surprise you what the Lord has done. Count your blessing. Don't count your sorrow. Count your blessing. What has the Lord done? What is the Lord doing for you? Right where you are, start counting your blessing. The devil does not want you to count your blessing. The devil wants you to count your losses. Counting your losses is the beginning of depression. Counting your losses is the beginning of frustration. When you focus your mind on what God has not done, you will not find a reason to see his faithfulness. But when you focus on the things he has already done, there you understand how faithful he is. God is too faithful to fail. The things he has not yet done could be an adjustment of a better day. A better opening. The things he is yet to do could be a preparation on your part for what he is about to do for you. Count your blessing. Right where you are, I don't know where life has positioned you, but I want you to understand that there is need for you as a family, as a company, as a businessman, a businesswoman to start counting. Start counting your blessing. Count your blessing. Where were you before? Where are you now? Count your blessing. The things you have today were once a prayer point. Count your blessing. The things your children have today, they were once a desire. You once prayed for these things to happen. Now it has happened. I want you to start counting your blessing. This year is running towards its end. Count your blessing. Count your blessing and it will surprise you. Start counting your blessing and you will understand that God is faithful. God is merciful. God is compassionate. God is good. God is good. I did mention this to us in recent times. That when God is in control, you will not be in charge. In other words, if you are in charge, that means you are, God is not in control. The proof that God is in control is when you are not in charge. Things will not go the way you want. Things must not go the way you want for you to know that God is faithful. The faithfulness of God goes beyond, the satisf beyond your satisfaction. The faithfulness of God goes beyond your human satisfaction. Whether he blesses me or not, he is my God. Whether he heals me or not, he is my healer. Understand this truth. Begin to count your blessing. Count your blessing. Count your blessing. And it will surprise you what the Lord has done. The word of the Lord came to me saying, this is our time. This is our moment. This is our season. I am here by the help of the Holy Spirit to be a blessing to you. As always, never you forget this. Better is not good enough. The best is here to come. Keep loving Jesus. Keep praying. Keep loving him. Keep loving him. He has a plan. And one thing is sure you will live to see the fulfillment of his promises in your life this season. The Lord bless you. Shalom.